Hey guys, it's Tara. Um, I wanted to share um, this canvas that I made. Um, this is actually my first um, mixed media um, type of canvas that I've ever made. Um, and I had a really fun time making it and I just wanted to share it with you guys. And sorry about the computer angle. I've been trying to um, set it up so where you could see it. I'm just going to have to hold it and kind of show you because um, it's kind of far away and the computer and just everything. I couldn't get it. Um, figured out but um, this is the canvas um, and I think it is an eight and a half by eleven um, so I'm just gonna kind of share um, with you what I did um, first I went over the whole canvas with um, with gesso um, and then I had put down some lace I had this awesome um, lace uh, curtain um, so I cut a piece and I don't know if you could see it in the background there you can kind of see it right here um, and then I added some some doilies as you can see and I actually had one over here too but I wind up covering it up um, but I started out with um, the frame it's just a regular Michaels frame and this is an image from um, the uh, fairy graphics or the graphics graphic fairies um, online um, and then um, I added some um, flowers, some big um, roses here, a cluster of flowers. This is a um, butterfly brooch. Um, this is some Prima vines. I don't know if you can see it right here. Some vines, some roses, some different paper flowers. This is a metal frame right here, and I put a pearl in the middle. Um, this is a little charm that says, um, what does it say, laugh? It says laugh. Um, this is a spool here, um, a little domino back there. This was a big resin heart. Um, these right here um, are actually just some black gems that I had. I added some pearls. Um, and this is actually some kind of screw or something from my husband's tool bag. I just have a bunch of them. Um, some more roses, flowers, another gem, pearl. Um, I added some little resin flowers in there. This is a, um, a birdcage um, charm that I had. Um, and I just kind of, it took me a while because I couldn't really vision what it was going to look like um, after I painted it all white. And all these things that I used were all different colors. Um, so it was kind of looking crazy. Um, and so I started... Um, I basically did this bottom part first um, and then I painted it um, just so I could see kind of where I was going and I and I liked it so I just kept on going um, and I added some little pearl um, stamens there some more roses another one of the um, screws um, a lot of flowers as you can see um, back here I don't know if you could see um, I had a broken piece of a picture frame so I just added that to the back um, this was actually a copper flower, and now I have learned that I can't use those type of flowers because the paint um, does not go over it. Um, it just happened to match this project, so I was happy. Um, but it turned the paint um, all pink, so everything I painted was like turning pink. So, um, and I have some more pearls up here, another one of those gems. Sorry, I'm kind of like um, a big key back here. Um, and so, and then I added, um, these were just um, those sticker letters. It says bold and beautiful. And then I went over everything with gesso um, and used my Recollections $1.99 sprays. Um, and I also had two um, Glimmer Mists, um, just um, like a pink and a teal, and I kind of did that um, all around. So that's my canvas I just wanted to share it with you guys I'm sorry again about the angle I know it's kind of hard to see and with the light and everything but um, this is one of my first canvases and I'm really happy um, with the way it turned out and I'm excited to do more so um, I just wanted to share that with you guys thank you so much um, for watching and taking the time to watch my video um, and I'll be back shortly